Hi, this is Spike Robinson, and I'm here with a message for all of my XJW friends. I know that right now with the Russian ban, all of you have a very strong opinion on it one way or another, and that is absolutely fine. But what I'd like to remind all of you is just because you disagree with someone does not mean that you have to be hateful or rude, or even not friends anymore. Those of you who are my age and older will remember a wonderful show called Siskel and Ebert at the movies. They were two very good movie reviewers who would often disagree incredibly with each other over whether or not a movie was any good. Now, of course, whether or not a whole country should ban an entire religious movement is a much bigger deal than whether or not a movie is good, but it's the same principle that counts. The point that you can disagree agreeably and with respect. Now, me myself, I feel that knowing what I know about how high control abusive groups work and the history of where and when they've been banned shows that banning them only drives them underground, gives them a sense of elitism, and drives their membership up, if anything. However, I'm not the be-all and end-all of all opinions, and there's some very, very good reasons that people are happy to see the Russian government ban Jehovah's Witnesses because it is definitely a vote of no confidence against a cruel and horrible organization that is hurting its members. That said, however, I think that it's the wrong decision for the, for, I would say the right reasons, but it's not going to work and it's only going to make things worse in the long run. But if one of my friends or somebody who I don't even know disagrees with me, that's okay. <laughs> no skin off my nose. Um, as a citizen here in America, I have little to no control over what's done in Russia. But I would like to say that some of my dear friends who are ex-Jehovah's Witnesses, I've seen a lot of unpleasant interactions with each other and not blaming anybody because, yeah, we're passionate people and that's a good thing. So say your piece, say what you believe and why you believe it, but remember that if somebody disagrees with you, it's good for both of you to sit down and talk about why rather than to hate because talking together is how we're going to solve problems. And hating on each other, it just ain't cool, folks. So, I love you all. Be well. Have a good evening.